last weekend in April, and we are in search of the March Brown Hatch. On your oh, good. For the March Brown Hatch, we tie our own pattern. It's just a variation of a CDC caddis. Just gonna tie up one last fly before fishing this morning. Hoping for the March brown hatch. Gonna use a gray dubbing. I'm not gonna put on microfibits like Tim does, just because I'm lazy. I do think it works better, but not sure it really matters. Sometimes the simplest of flies work the best. Just like, you know, an apple pie recipe. Apples, sugar, cinnamon, pie crust, done. Pretty darn good. Anyways, so a little bit of dubbing. I'm not fussy about CDC. I often will use a cut piece. such as this. It's just denser, so I think it helps float. So I use three pieces, stack them up, stack them up, slap them on, tie them down. Such a simple pattern, works so well. Clean this up a little bit. Okay, and we're out of good head cement. So use a little bit of Tim Zappagap. Put this on. Whip finish. And we'll head out to the river. I'm poking through the eye because that Zappa Gap man likes to fill gaps. Voila! Wish me luck! When I fish these CDC flies, I like to put a little either Loxa or Aquel on the body, pull back the feathers, give it a little dab. I think it's lighting up. <laughs> Probably not. Come on. Oh, he's out. Oh, see, that's that good cutthroat that we saw. Woohoo! Well, I just came over and screwed up my day. <laughs> oh, he's a beauty. Yeah. Whoa. Yeah, I know you want to go. Whoa! Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Warrior. Huh? <laughs> Ready to say something, Mr. Howe? No, well, when you took off your camera, it really got me going. <laughs>
Which camera was and it? Show yeah. Which camera, Which was camera it? did I take off, John? Your breast one. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, good friends, good times. Oh my gosh, the hatch was so good yesterday. I'm back today with friends Dave and Bob. Epic March brown hatch, a little slower today than yesterday. Next week it's off to the Missouri. Hey, see you next Thursday. <laughs>